and uh, also we do know that some civil society organizations working in the northern sector of our country, they are seeking to partner government to find a lasting solution to perennial floodings being experienced up north, led by Star Ghana. The group intends to construct water holding dams capable of absorbing torrential rainwater and also excess water from the Bagri and Kompenga dams. Although excess water from the Bari and Kopianga dams in Burkina Faso is yet to be spilled, the five regions in the north have been experiencing severe flooding. Hundreds of residents in the Garu, Timpani and Binduri districts have been displaced, having lost their farmland, farm produce and other property to floods. The floods were caused largely by the ongoing Tamni irrigation dam project and torrential rains. And this is what civil society groups are working to address both in the short and the long term. For example, working and, uh, with the government to construct, you know, water holding bodies is, is important because these are uh, capital intensive projects. It's only government that can do it. And so that uh, once this uh, uh, long term interventions are in place, at least we'll have a, a reduced uh, impact and devastation uh, with regards to flood in northern Ghana. Star Ghana program manager Eunice Agbanyaji further spoke about some of the short-term measures being adopted to help reduce the impact of floods this year. Those include intensifying sensitization to increase response of communities to evacuation. So the other is to uh, support uh, organization of resources mobilization to mobilize every resource uh, to respond to the emergency. NADMO Director General Nana Eric Ajiman Prempre welcomed the initiative and interventions from the civil society groups. We are hands on deck. This roadmap will lead to the expected outcomes. So that in the next five years we can all put ourselves in the back and be proud of what we have achieved for the people of the five northern regions of the country as a whole. Our part, not to play is in full support from the national headquarters, regional and district offices. He emphasized a long-term solution is key in addressing the perennial problem and to save national resources.